And here's question 5. Okay, so 3y plus 7 equals minus 14. So what we've got is we need to try and get rid of this 7. So obviously to do that, it's plus 7. So we just take away 7. And again, you have to take away 7 here. Okay, so what we've got is 3y, 7 minus 7, 0 equals, and it's minus 21. Okay, now don't let this number with a minus put you off. Okay, so it's the exact same process as the last time. We want to, it's 3y, we want it just to be y. So if we divide that side by 3, so it's basically what y's been times by, then divide this by 3. Okay, so you end up having y equals 7. Okay, and that's the answer to that question.